I don't know about you guys, but I am not a big fan of sunscreen. I don't like the way that it smells. I don't like all the chemicals in it. I don't like the way that it feels on my skin. I don't like that I have to reapply it multiple times throughout the day. And then even after that, it still might get washed away and I might get burned anyway. So what if, I, what if there is a supplement you could take by mouth that worked like sunscreen and even better? Well, that exists. What's up guys, welcome back to another video. I'm Scott with drscotthealth.com. I help people transform their lives through health, fitness, and personal growth. If you're into that, make sure you subscribe for daily videos and turn on the notification bell. Now, summer is just right around the corner here. It is June, I think summer is officially June 25th, the solstice, and so it's just right around the corner. The, the sun is ramping up, more UV, radiation bearing down on us so and we also are seeing in this 2020 coronavirus COVID-19 shutdown thing that we're experiencing things are opening up people are going out more going to the beach in many places and in places down to the river and this and that and so uh, that's a great thing we're getting more vitamin D you know through uh, the sun and our skin synthesizing that natural source of vitamin D that's going to help our immune system and our lungs, all that good stuff, all these other processes in our body. But we're more vulnerable to, to those UV rays and skin cancer, melanoma, sunburn, all those things that we don't want. We don't want to go out there and bake like, like a lobster. And so if, if you're like me, if you're not really a big fan of sunscreen, if you would like to avoid it, I want to introduce to you this amazing alternative. And this alternative is astaxanthin. Now, what the heck is astaxanthin? Now, most of you have probably heard of Mega Red, uh, which is krill oil. So krill oil, the thing that makes Mega Red red is a pigment in it called astaxanthin. And the most abundant form of this is comes from a algae, actually a microalgae, and a lot of it is harvested in, in Hawaii. Krill feed on these algae and they ingest it and that gives them their color. This is actually the algae that flamingos eat to get their color, that pinkish, pinkish salmonish color, and salmon, that's where the salmon gets its color. So, Astaxanthin is actually a pigment and it is an antioxidant. So we all know that antioxidants, we've heard of that term like, oh, antioxidants are really great for anti-aging. They fight the free radicals, whatever that means. So what that actually means is that inside your body, there are things called reactive oxygen species, which just means there's molecules in your body that just react to things very in a very negative way. They can damage your cells, they can damage your DNA. And so we need to neutralize these threats. We need to neutralize all these free radicals that can go around causing all this damage in your body, it can cause wrinkles and aging and leathery alligator skin. Nobody wants that, right? So astaxanthin is one of the most powerful antioxidants. It's something like 6,000 times more powerful than vitamin C as an antioxidant. Now what is also cool about astaxanthin is that if you take it daily, this is, a, this is an effect that takes a little bit of time to build up in the body. It takes about 30 days or so. And after about 30 days, you will notice that you can be out in the sun and you don't burn at all or you you it is you burn much much less it is incredible now i stumbled upon this very interesting little fact about astaxanthin i was working in the summer outdoors a lot one summer i had my arm out the window a lot it was just getting beat down and red so i, I kept it inside put sunscreen on and at the time i started taking this astaxanthin because i heard so many great things about it i heard that it could it's this amazing antioxidant that could help my give me a little bit better clarity and focus it could help with my eye vision and just be better for my health okay so i'm taking this and then i noticed that i'm back out into the sun and i'm like okay wow um i've actually had my arm out the window and i haven't put i've forgotten to put sunscreen on 
and I have not gotten burned at all. And so I started testing this more and I'm, so I'm just like blatantly putting my arm out the window the whole day, just blasting myself with sun, like going to the beach, not putting on, purposely not putting on any sunscreen, any protection, and I'm not burning, I'm getting a nice tan, but I am not burning. As you can see, I am pretty white. I'm not the fairest of skins, but you know, I do have some Mexican genes in me. So I'm like one eighth Mexican and so I'll burn really bad, but then it's like the Mexican genes come in and then turn it into a tan. Anyways, that's, that's a whole, we'll digress. So how can you achieve this effect? So basically what you need to know is that you can begin to take astaxanthin and it takes about 30 days to build up in the body and then you will notice that it has this natural sunscreen effect. You're basically taking a supplement into your mouth, ingesting it, and it acts as if it is sunscreen. But you don't have to put on this gross oily stuff that has a bunch of gnarly chemicals in it and you don't like the smell, you have to reapply. You can get rid of all of that just by taking a supplement that's naturally going to help you. It's going to reduce aging effects, it's going to reduce the, your, the wrinkles that are gonna come in from sun exposure, and it's just gonna overall give you a better health. So it, this is a pretty amazing deal. And I, so this happened to me on accident, and I, and I later researched it to figure it out, and I'm like, oh, okay, there is research and science behind that, that it does protect against sun damage. It protects against melanoma and skin cancer. So pretty cool. I thought I'd share this quick little tip with you. I don't have any at the moment. I'm actually just bought some and it's coming in. The sun's ramping up and I'm ready to gear up because I don't want to put on that sunscreen. And what I use is a brand called BioAstin. I highly recommend that. It's worked great. I use the 12 milligram strength. I'll put that up on the screen. And so that's what I would recommend that you use. And remember, you can, you can go out and try to use it uh, right away, but more than likely, it's going to take at least two two weeks to 30 days in order for this uh, effect to take place in your body. Well, that's going to do it for this video. Keep things short and sweet. I hope that you found this informative. Please give it a like if you did find it helpful. And subscribe to this channel if you are interested in becoming the best version of yourself through health, fitness, and personal growth. We have a lot of amazing content that gets put out and daily videos are being pumped out as we speak. So join the community and until the next video, take care and to your health.